Jeepers! Come out, come out to play! Kayo Live Seller, what's happening? It's your boy Dread Reaper, and guys, I'm here getting it done. I'm here with the infamous. One and only. Definitely. Also, Corey, also, get him a little insight on what you like, what you're about to do right now, by the way. I'm about to make a 10,000 <laughs> 10, calorie mac and cheese, seafood, crab meat, mm. shrimp, mm. lobster, mm. four different cheeses. Mm. I thought it was three. It's four. It's supposed to be four. <laughs> you told me to get the mozzarella, well, pepper jack, and the sharp cheddar, bro. Right? You never told me to get the no, other he one. So we're gonna do he said three cheese. He missed one, so we're gonna no, do No, 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 I didn't miss one. You told me three cheese, bro. <laughs> You know what I'm saying, but um, yeah. So we're gonna we're gonna make sure Corey walk you guys through this whole uh, process here. And if you guys want more uh, tips on how to like make mac and cheese like this, you know, hit up. Uh, what's your IG, Corey? K985. All right. So the first thing he's adding. The first thing I'm gonna add. What do you usually add that I that I took out? See, because you know this this for me. So I usually saute some onions, but Dre doesn't like onions. It inflames you. You guys don't need that. I saute onions and a little bit of garlic. Also, information, you guys don't need that. That's it. So, I want no garlic, no onions. So, so what are you going to saute? A little bit, and I'm going to saute some flour. <laughs> 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 you ever heard of sauteing flour? No, you have to. Because you, wanna <laughs> you don't want your mac and cheese to taste like flour, so you want to saute your flour. That's why. Okay. Okay. Wow. See, guys, I'm getting you guys the insight <laughs> of Mr. Knight himself breaking the recipe down to you guys. I got my water with a little bit of oil, a little bit of salt for the noodles, the elbows. The elbows, and he's. Whoa. Whoa. So, Corey, do you measure your flour? I don't really measure it out. I've been making this so long, I just eye it out. <laughs> it's, all, it's all in the sight. <laughs> so you just eye it out. You just. And guys, listen, I, I told Corey he needed to create a YouTube and like, cause he also was able to um, put some ingredients, I mean, cook up some uh, jerk chicken wings and ribs. I'm gonna show you guys all that later. But right now, you know, I'll make you guys walk you through this mac and cheese. So, we got the flour sauteing. He got he got a half and half by the put on. Half and half, I'm gonna put. Do you have to put half and half? Why yeah. not just regular? With regular milk, you can, but it's best to use half and half. So you hit it. This is your. This is gonna be your basic cheese sauce that we're about to make here. So you you're you making scratch. mac and cheese from scratch. This is important. This is vital. I don't know how to make mac and cheese from scratch. You know, I'm always willing to learn. You know what I'm saying? Because at the end of the day. You're never too advanced to learn something. Cool. So. so you want to put a little bit of seasoning into your sauce. A little oregano. Oregano. That's not going to flame you. <laughs> <laughs> so like what, 10 dash? 10 shakes? Five shakes of oregano. You know. You want to put a little parsley. You won't taste none of this. Is that up again against the screen there? A little parsley, a couple of shakes. And guys, you know, Corey's kind of old school, so nothing is measured, which is which is okay. So you guys see it's like seven shakes, you know. He said two, but it's like seven shakes, you know. Wanna shake a little bit of black pepper? So like five shakes, guys, five shakes. <laughs> You know, don't have a heavy hand, you know. No. And then a little shake of salt. Salt. Now I'm gonna start adding in our cheese. This is pepper jack. For some reason, they don't shred it. So. Yeah, you know, we was looking hard for that too. We was looking to store for hard for that. For some reason, they don't shred it, so you gotta shred your own pepper jack. But for this part, you can just cut it up and then it's going to melt out. Hey, 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 hey. Sharp cheddar, you're going to add one bag. 
Let's see, that's a, it gets serious, guys. This is what the calories get right here. Mozzarella, you gotta add one back. All that's gonna melt. Guys, this is where the calories get serious right here. That he just took two servings of. This is eight, eight servings, eight servings, and it's 80 calories each serving. So, you know, it's 80 times eight, guys. You know, that is loaded, you know, and that's just two packets he just had. So, you guys can see how serious this is getting already. So, oh yeah, let me go ahead and give you guys a half, I mean, an insight on the half and half here. The half and half is 32 servings. 32 servings. It's 25 calories each servings. So you guys do the math on that. 32 times 25. So, this is a uh, Serious, the cows are adding up, guys. Water starting to boil. Drop it in. I'm going to cook this for eight minutes, exactly. Mm. You don't want it too soft, you don't want it too hard. Eight Important minutes. part, guys. That's the only thing I measure right there. <laughs> <laughs> you want the L then So it's right in between from hard to soft. Five oh seven. I I see Corey made this last time guys and I'm like, whoa dude, that thing is loaded. But I gotta have it. I gotta try it. You know what I'm saying? But when he finished he sent me the Instagram uh, photos, I was like, dude, ain't no way. You know, Marshall was licking her fingers, <laughs> trying to dive through the phone. I'm like, B, relax. You know, eat the broccoli and chicken. We good. You know what I'm saying? But we're here getting it done at the night table. Oh. First thing. Oh. You wanna. <laughs> Guys, it ain't Thanksgiving, but man. You know, but like I said, this process right here. Is the important part, and we also waiting for the crab and the lobster. Crab and lobster. It still hasn't reached. Am I gonna have to skip it out this time, man? Get out of my face, Reaper. Where you been at, bro? Young bro, low. Where you been at, bro? You know I've been working. Give me the stuff. Give me the stuff. MVP on the way. Give me the stuff. You know what I mean? Hey, you took forever. An hour, bro. He said he's supposed to be here. Hour. I don't care about the rain. You're in a car. You're in a car, bro. You keep talking about it. Safety first, guys. Safety first. You first. So, this is crab right here, guys. Smells damn good, by the way. That crab meat right there, gumbo mm. mug. You eat it just like that. It's already mm. cooked. Wow. So my plug is late. <laughs> Hey, 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 what happened when the plug is late, man? What happened when the plug is late? What we do to hey, win? What, what we, we do, do to the plug when the plug is late, man? Hey. Hey, Marshall, grab the pistol. Grab the pistol, Marshall. You know what I'm saying? Just, 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 all right, brother. Listen. Let's go, let's go. Tell them what's up, man. Tell them what you got coming out. Um, Tell them what you got. MVP do. on the way. That means more vibes, please, because that's what the people want. That's what we provide. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah. yeah. More vibes, please. Real niggas say what's up? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, <laughs> <laughs> niggas late. <laughs> How much pounds would you say this is for? That's like five. Okay, check that out, Five to four pounds of lobster. Guys, it smells good. And then you can eat it raw. And you can eat it just like the crab meat. Wow. That's a lot so, of... Uh, we can't mince lobster, so we got to just slice it up because, you know, these are actual claws. Mm. All meat. Mm -hmm. So we're just going to dice it up a little bit. Wow. So when we layer the mac and cheese, it's not too thick. Wow. 
Now, then this is this is not something that we're gonna buy from the restaurant. This is something that we're doing right now in the night table. Are y'all hey, it's gonna start bringing the ring, right? Yeah. Little bit, right? So we're just gonna dice up that lobster. Nice chunks. Every bite you take, you're gonna have a nice bite of lobster. And if you guys are looking, you know, to like order a dish or something like that, or you know, definitely go to uh, the Instagram is night eighty five, night k eighty five, night k eighty five, and literally, we will shoot you guys a price um, and have you guys. Uh, you do delivery? Yeah. You know, he delivered and stuff like that. Um, and if you guys don't believe me, you know, you guys could really. Um, have people like Lady O back me up on this because she's also sitting over there watching this being done. I say, guys, um, this is a 10,000 uh, calorie, no, 15, close to 15,000 calories, and it's pretty serious. And probably even more now, now that they got it meat and stuff, yep. it's probably even more because this one can is. 45 calories but uh Sorry, guys okay. you know it's eight ounce i mean i mean eight servings so eight times 45 marsha is pretty good at math how much is that mm. <laughs> 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 and we got by close to about three to five pounds of our lobster here guys and we don't know the cows for that but we know we're gonna we're gonna assume it's somewhere in the hundreds That lobster, and you can eat it. Take you want me to do what? Really? Yeah. Taste yeah. the crab meat. Taste the crab meat. Tastes just like tuna. You can eat it like that. If you ever get that, you just put it in your bread and voila. Knock some bread and uh. Yeah. You don't want to try the crab? Mm -hmm. I don't know why you don't like seafood, but seafood is the best. All right, cheese heating up. to cook this stuff because it's going to cook in the macaroni and cheese for like 30, 40 minutes. So you don't want to cook that and then cook it in here. You're going to overcook it and it's going to be dry. he does stuff so I don't smell it. Oh, okay. I don't have this smoke. So we're going to... I'm 
gosh, this is, let me get a photo of this, hold on. Wow. You know, like I said, this is videos particularly to all the ectomorphs out there who's trying to put on that extra little weight. Um, like I said, hit up Knight K85. My brother Will. Um, put your dish up. You know, guys DM him. He'll go ahead and uh, tell you guys the prize, the quote, and everything, and what you need, and blah, blah, blah. blah he's the best. So always cover it up with four when you start initially put it in. And how long? And how long? No, it's 30, 25 minutes. Well, you'll know when it's ready. <laughs> hey, you're just eyeing it. Just eye it, man. Just eye it. After 25 minutes, you know your crab meat is nice and cooked. Hey, oh, don't do this to me. Alright, guys. So, your boy is undefeated once again. I came over to the Knights, destroyed them. It's all good. You know, the ladies stand no chance, believe it or not. But back to what is really popping, guys. This, these dishes here. They look like pizza. <laughs> so what was that? Twenty minutes there. Yeah, like twenty minutes. So now you gonna let it get a cone on top? No, we're gonna let it bake some more with the flour paper off. 